G'day guys, welcome back to Wombat Gaming. We are still playtesting this um, really cool game called the Bellrite. It is in playtest only, you can't get it at the moment. It is available to put on wish list on Steam and um, yeah, look, I'm really enjoying this. This is an open world, um, yeah, building, crafting, researching, RPG, anything kind of medieval. Um, ticks all the boxes for me I'm really enjoying it anyway we've uh, done a few live streams this is another one today we're going to be just exploring a little bit more um, I'm just gonna see what's around we've got limited time left on this game so I've got a companion with me one of my, my better well-armed companions we're gonna venture off into some of these areas that we haven't been before we are looking for some things like garlic and stuff I just want to see whether we can find things like that and boars we haven't been able to find them just yet uh, looks like we might have uh, something up here in the hills. What do we got here? A wolf. Wolves are pretty easy to deal with. Um, but we are looking for yeah, unusual things other than the normal. So we're kind of just trying to get off the beaten track a little bit and don't really want to get involved in any wolves at the moment. So we'll head up this way. We are looking for boars. Um, and we are trying to improve our archery skills, actually. Uh, which I will continue to, to read these books to increase our archery skill. And see if we can actually nail a, a deer or two. We've only managed to get one. Okay, what have we got down here? We've got a brigands camp. Maybe, probably a few too many. I'm not sure. It's probably, well, we can give it a go. We, I'll save the game here and... Just do right this one and we'll see how we go um all right so we've worked out a few commands here um she is so like e is for commanding her to to march down there so what we'll do is i'll get her to go to there and then i'll bring out my crossbow i mean my archery bow how we're gonna go here but now nah, she's down ready yeah I think we're in a bit of trouble here yeah these guys are way too strong for me I had, a, had the feeling that they probably be the case uh, that's totally fine we'll reload that saved game and uh, see how we go but um, yeah look uh, it's challenging which is great. I, I have played some games recently where the combat was way too easy. So um, we are still in this game researching uh, things like uh, different... Like, in fact, I have not upgraded any of the armor on me at all. That probably didn't help that little situation just then. I was relying on my um, archery skills to get us where we wanted. I probably do need to upgrade that sort of stuff to some thicker stuff. Um, we are missing fur and, and that's the boars. So without the fur, we kind of are in trouble. So we will continue on up the hill. We'll avoid those guys then knowing that we, yeah, we might have had a chance, but I don't think maybe needed one or two more companions with me to, to do that. Um, I was exploring a little bit before earlier and I came across like some ancient ruins that gave me some gold coin which was pretty cool and all these books that I'm currently reading actually we, are, we did start again so that's how we're still reading our archery book uh, that's how we upgrade our um, you know, skills in this game you don't do it by you know building or crafting or like other games you do it you know this one you have to actually read and learn as you go now the only issue I had with her recently was she left me because she got hungry all right, there's still walls. We want to keep going up this way. Looking for boars. And a, a rabbit. Would probably be an easy kill, but we don't want rabbits. We want deer. Or the boars. So let's keep going up here. Let's see if we can find something different. And we are looking for garlic, as I said. That was one of the things that popped up on my new list okay there's a deer up there like i said my skills with the this thing are not too good 
And there is a sneak ability that I'm aware of just yet. Um, maybe I mean, when you do aim, he does sneak a little bit. Uh, no, missed that one. Oh, man, straight past me. See ya. Oh, seriously? Yeah. I never worked out how to cancel the arrow. That's alright, we've got 28 arrows left. Alright, we've got some men over the ridge here. What are they? Bandits. Alright, we want to... There's three, three of them? Um... We might have a uh, luck here. Shocking. All right, they're coming around here. The looks. Um, still trying to get used to the directions on this thing a little bit. All right. Oh, they're over here. We got a little bit of a. All right, this uses my. All right, where is she? Oh my gosh, she's in the wrong location. She's supposed to be made by command companion. I think I'll be starting this again. Where'd she go? She's supposed to be following me, for God's sake. Oh my God, seriously. This turned out to be a disaster. Um, she is somewhere over here, but I cannot see her. And there she is up the hill there. I don't know why. Ah, oh, she's hungry. All right, this happens um, sometimes when they're hungry. All right, they've run off. Um, when your companion gets hungry, uh, you can see the hungry symbol. They desert you. And I did forget to bring food, so that was completely another stupid of me. Anyway. Yeah, and she now will not come back to me. And this is like glitch in the game, I think. She is just like, you know, running off. God knows, I don't know where she's even running, to be honest. We have another bandits camp over there, I'd say. But you can see my companion is just like taking off. So you need to keep them well fed. Um, these guys are coming back with some more of a look, so... I don't know. Can I outrun and... she fight with me we'll see no she's running <laughs> oh my god are you kidding me come on seriously so this would not I guess happen in normal life it doesn't really make much sense to be honest but she would just take off like that and these guys where these guys go No, they've, they've, they've totally disappeared now. All right, we're up in the middle of nowhere. My companion has completely deserted me because they're hungry. I don't think I have any food on me at all, so... We'll have a look. But no, I don't, didn't bring any. So I didn't think to bring food with me. That was my stupidity. Uh, okay, so let's have a look at this map. We, it's a pretty big world, as you can see. And we're kind of like in the middle of nowhere at the moment. Um, so we'll just keep going. Boars, I wouldn't expect to live in areas like this. It's quite barren up here. There's not much happening at all. A lot of looks. Good view. But 
Yeah, alright, so we've run all the way up here and there's really nothing up here at all. And my companion... Should be able to just send home if I can figure out where that is. So we'll see if she heads home now. We'll go it alone. Next time I need to bring lots of food with me. No, she's still staying up in the hills. No, but probably, I don't know if that's a game glitch or not, but that's a, a little bit silly to me if you ask me. It needs to be fixed. Um, okay, so... For some reason... Maybe altitude affects you. I'm pretty high up and all I'm doing is walking. But as I walk, my... Look at my, um, yeah, it goes down really quick, and it, um, uh, now it's starting to get a bit better now. Alright, we'll head down here. We've, this is the area that we haven't been into before, so we'll try and clear some, some area down here, try and find some, some ruins or whatever else may be in this land. So far, no boars or garlic. Mushrooms, not like mushrooms. All right, let's have a look. We have explored this bit, so head around this way. And the only catch too when die if you do die out this far, I mean your goods do drop to the ground, you can recover them, but it is if you're a long way from your settlement, it could be very frustrating. Uh the other factor that you probably have the problem with uh you can do multiple setting uh, settlements, I believe. I haven't really gotten far enough through this game to do that just yet. We're still working on our main one. Uh look, I didn't realise uh, the days go really quick too here, and there's no fast travel points. So that can be a little bit frustrating, so it's probably something the developers maybe could look at. Um, either fast travel or longer days. Alright, what have we got here? Oh, we've been seeing this guy before, I think. Have we? Um, okay, I need to put this away. Sorry, I don't have time for chat right now. He doesn't have time to chat, really? Sorry, I don't have Hmm, okay. I think that's the guy that I was actually supposed to leave town and he hasn't left town, so hmm, I come back to bite me that one. It was a quest that I did for the local village to get rid of him. They may not be happy that he is stuck around. Alright, well we're back towards home. Uh it is nine o'clock. As I said the days go really quick. We set off during the day and <laughs> I'd love to know where my companion is. She's coming, very slowly, but she's coming. Um, all right, well, we probably this time around need to load up with food. Yeah, mushrooms. Um, it's good that guys are cooking mushrooms. And then, yeah, we'll um, got some more books, cooking, crafting. Do some crafting. Learning here. All right. Um, it's probably too early to hit the sack just yet. We'll collect a few things. What we'll do is we'll load up on. Well, hopefully that companion will come back because she's a pretty good companion. Um, and then we'll head off with with food and see if we can find boars and mushrooms. And like I said, I need to really do work on this armor situation. Oh, 
too quick. Sometimes I get up too quickly with these out and it's got to wait till it pulls out. Uh, during the summer months, it's good to collect as much of this stuff that doesn't grow in the winter. So you can make, continue to make things. Um, stocking up on you know, the mushrooms, the guys that, you know, mushrooms, any meat we can find. Actually, that's something I need to fix. The uh, rabbits haven't, traps haven't been sorted. And you can only uh, put food into them during the summer months. They don't work terribly well in winter unless you've got an abundance of berries to put in there. So we'll go down here and we'll make some traps because I know there's a couple of them are broken. For this one, so let's get rid of this stuff. Uh, do we have any wood in here? What? Yeah, we had some wood. Takes a bit of time crafting this stuff yourself, but everyone's headed to sleep by the look, so. Actually. We'll let them do that. Everyone's. Oh, let's get. Start it fresh. Hopefully my other companion will be back and we can load up on some food and stuff and head off again in a different direction. So yeah, so we have four days for winter. Oh, we got a raid expected. That's generally yeah, the next day. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So, um, um One thing we don't have is bandages. I just have that set up to be made pretty sure. Maybe, I, yeah, maybe it was a one off. We need to have that topped up all the time bandages because that's something that's pretty easy to make. Although we need more sage. Um, okay, she. I will. Grab Tully's mushrooms. Give her a bunch of these as well. Keep some of myself um, making the traps. I could make these myself. Oh, can I? Hmm. Okay, we need two sage for every. Yeah, I didn't read that very well. What was it? Flax, one, two sage. Okay, so one flax, two sage. So six, so only 12 of the... Okay, so that should be six bandages. All right, so yeah, so you can, there's two options on these benches. One to do it yourself. One you can set up other people to do it. And here comes someone now actually to make bandages. You can see they're carrying the goods. So, but we we need the bandages. I think take with us.
okay. Wasn't paying attention then. This. What am I missing? Wood. I should be able to make this. Oh, hide maybe. Um, okay. All right. We kind of have. I think. Actually, let's top up. Well, let's just head off. We've got um, a lot of different ways this time. We will head into this area. Where have we been? Yeah, let's set up this way. Let's just go the straight way this way. Expected tomorrow. Two two raids tomorrow. Awesome. All right, well, we might get a couple of raids in before this live stream finishes. That's my companion. She's not even following me. Ah, uh, oh, okay. I don't know. I still got the can up the commands top right hand corner says she is in my party so I don't know why she's not following me oh. got one shot in but I got away too quick There. I need to stop. Okay, a rock wall. Which way did he go? Oh, there he is. Seriously, I need, I need stamina. Oh, come on. Seriously? I should have aimed for a headshot. Yeah, I've lost him. Yep, okay. We'll continue on. Alright, we've been in that tower before. We got something out of that one. Okay, we'll grab this paper, see if this leads us somewhere. It's not going to work. 
Let's go around the back of the tower. stuck here. Okay, it's not going to work either. This doesn't really go anywhere. We've been into there before and there was just some, some treasure we, we got out of this thing here. There's nothing else in here, so... Oh, I did miss this. Hmm, okay. Let's just some information on the settlement itself. Make sure I have a better look next time. Alright, we'll head... Head around this way then. Hemp is hard to find. Grab that while we while we can see it. Okay, we are still looking for garlic, um, so, do we books on us, yes, um, nope, we don't. Okay, this is like a small road here. That obviously goes down towards the village, but where does this go? Let's follow this. Okay, that goes to a dead end. Interesting. So the map says it's it seems quite big, but yeah, we've kind of got blocked all the way along here, so interesting. Um, it is obviously still a playtest, so this could open up. Um, definitely no garlic here, it's all stone and wood, uh, iron. And obviously future expansion wise they've got room to grow I guess as well. Alright, well yeah we're not really achieving much up here, that's the settlement down there. Uh, we're not finding anything real, really new going this way. Maybe should have head the other way. Because we know there's lakes and stuff behind me and quite a few bridges and things. So this could be like the furthest kind of north village by the looks because we're really not getting anywhere up this way. Alright, we're going to head back. This uh, turned into a little bit of a misadventure. Uh, we'll cut back through and keep an eye out for that garlic. I don't think we're going to come across any bo boars. Now, we did come across a note the other day. Oh no, it was a discussion with somebody about a hidden treasure inside the settlement. He thinks... He, so, oh, there's some garlic there. What a shame I can't just grab that. I can't. Uh, so that hidden... Yeah, that, that hidden um, hidden treasure would be cool if we could figure out what I'm looking for. So far, I haven't been able to figure that. Oh, look, who's here? Hello, you're like half an hour too late, but let's let's go. Yeah, all right. <laughs> So I guess, like, I haven't really investigated too many of these buildings. I mean, it could be hidden treasure around these things as well. You never know. 
I doubt it. We are kind of just looking for some sort of little pop-up icon or something. If it exists, all right, we are going to head the complete opposite direction. I think that's going to be the best solution at the moment. Winter's coming too, so we're going to want to collect some things I know we're going to need down towards the rivers. Um, do we pick up anything? I'll just unload anything we picked up while we're coming through. That's our food. Alright, let's um, head back out. Actually, quickly just check. And we'll take a couple of those more band aids. Um, I wonder if we can give them to her as well. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe she self heals. We'll see. All right, let's go the complete opposite direction and see whether we can find boars or garlic. Yeah, this time she's coming. I think the, the the whole deer thing, I, I only managed to ever kill one deer, I got kind of cornered and I actually just pulled out I think an axe and finished it off but I'm really struggling with this arrow, it seems to wound at 50%, 60%, they need to get that second shot off, oh here we go look. And off he goes. Ah, oh boy. Ah, oh well. Oh, there's the deer again. Oh. It's just it's getting close enough to the deer to get those two shots off is probably the key. No, too quick. All right, uh, we did need reeds. Uh, while we're down here, we might as well have a look. Although I could come back this way, I guess, so we won't collect too many. We haven't been much further than this particular spot this way, so we'll head this way and see what we can find. Okay, we got red down here. I think they have wolves. Yeah. There's more wolves over there by the looks too. There's a waterfall through here. Nice. to aim up higher. Oh, that was a nice shot. Right, I think Did that finish it off. The water's really weird. No, so three arrows for one wolf. Okay. I need to work on their um 
definitely work on the water. Oh. It looks nice, but it's it's completely random when you actually walk into it. I'll show you. It's run. It's so clear. It's even clearer under the water than it is above the water. And you don't seem to drown or anything. There's no drowning icon. I don't see. Where am I? It's just a whole new world under here. Okay. Um, we're going the wrong way anyway. We don't want to come this way. So we'll go back this way. But yeah, the water is a bit of a weird one. The sw whole swimming thing needs to be looked at. Can I get up here? Hmm, yes, I can. Again, my uh, companion has just deserted me. Alright, so it's a bit different the landscape up here. This ready kind of. These bushes are all kind of new. I haven't seen anything like this before. Not in this quantity anyway. But nothing's coming up as harvestable. So we are, I guess, still elusively looking for that garlic and the boars all right well probably criticism uh, a lot of space but and, and this is a play test so hopefully this will change but there's not a lot out here um, where are we we have some wolves behind us. Uh, we've run quite a bit and we really haven't come across anything but wolves. Still haven't found my garlic. Here's another road. Okay, we've got some sort of weird icon. I think it just might be to do with that copper there. Yeah, okay, that green, that a greeny rock is copper. Let's head up this way. Oh, okay, what do we got here? He's got all the white above him, so he's friendly. Uh, okay, yes, gotta put my arrow away. Are you in need of any natural remedies for your ailments? What does he sell? He sells garlic seeds, uh, but I have no way of actually planting them. So look, I'll buy one. I'm intrigued for the moment. Not that I'll probably have enough time to plant them in this playtest. It's coming to an end pretty soon. Um, and he's just got a various other things. But we get sage, flax, hemp where we are already. So um, we could. What can we sell him? Nothing. We see. Yeah, so so this is in the area, f hopefully, that indicates that garlic can be found around here. I noticed the other herbalist, the stuff that you could buy off him, you could actually find around him. So we'll have a bit of a quick look. And then I noticed down there there's another fishing area that we definitely... Oh, and there's another city to my left a bit. Okay. All right, let's head that way. Um stone no i don't know where my companion's gone let's head towards what's this companion no there she's there so Okay, hopefully she'll follow me. Oh, she's hungry. Oh, I gave her so much food it wasn't funny. Okay, um, so six mushrooms was not enough for her. Still no garlic. Alright, we got a little town up here. So, something new. Okay. The 
those peasants should be more grateful. You're new around here, huh? Watch your back, stranger. Those bandits don't take kindly to outsiders. I'm deeply sorry, but I don't want to talk... Your offer is kind, but I'm afraid I can't accept help from someone. Nothing worth telling. All right. Um, hunting village. We're like a. There was a time when we were more welcoming. Skills-wise, nothing special. Ago. Nothing different, and we don't have any reputation with this. So I think multiple settlements, when we finally get things working, would be pretty good. Uh, but this particular place here, but it looks. Uh, let's have a look. We've got some quests and stuff we can do here. Mint, copper. Still have not come across that. Garlic. Let's head out of town. I'm going to turn... She's so far away from me anyway. But her, uh, back to a worker and hopefully she'll... Head back that way. So keeping an army, you can imagine keeping an army with you. Supplying food to all those people. That'd be crazy. No fall damage. So the um uh, 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 if you notice when I'm eating I'll show you what quickly. We've got um, my agility is only 2 out of 10 getting there, but agility seems to work go up quicker when you when you have eaten. Oh, we've got some banners nearby. I wonder if I have anything of value on me that I want to... Oh, I've got too much stuff on me. Oh, but... Uh, these pitchfork dudes are really hard to kill, though. My fighting skills are really bad. Putting a bandage on myself while I'm trying to run isn't the best. They gave up after a little while, but I killed the other guy, but I just need to... Hey... That guy's just taken off! Okay, I think that's a... Gotta be a glitch. Unless he's related to... Here he comes again. Get. I've got some renown for that too, so cool. Um, got an apple, some coin. Let's see if we can find the other guy we killed. It's getting dark, and we've got to raid you tomorrow. Um, let's see, I ran too far. No idea where I took him down. It was here somewhere. Alright, bodies disappear way too quickly. That's frustrating. I don't want to go that way. Bandit camp. 
But uh, yeah, I killed him somewhere here, and I'm sure he's loot sitting here somewhere, but... Oh, there we go. Oh, we got some books and some coins, some mushrooms. What have we got? Shields. Get research. Okay. Shields. We have nothing on shields. Alright, that's um... I don't know what happened to all my bandages. I thought I had three or four bandages on me, but... They ain't there no more, that's for sure. Alright. Well, this was uh, a, a nice little adventure, but we really didn't accomplish anything. We found one town, didn't find the boars or the garlic. And we have a raid due tomorrow, and it is already 10.30 at night. So it is a long way back home. If we run too far, I've got to run through this territory as well. My companion is still sitting out here. I have no idea why. All right, we're going to make our way home and hopefully be back in time to help fend off this raid. Across this bridge. Oh my god, seriously. Actually, they're on top of the hill there. I'll go see if I can just run through this water. Grab this hemp. Yeah, so this the water's a, a big glitch they need to fix, that's for sure. Lots of stones in the like in the river though. Hopefully I can get out of here, we'll go all this way for nothing. Yep, seem to work out. Alright, well, stick around. We have a attack on our settlement due imminently. We're just making our way back there now. Uh, it's due tomorrow, which is in like 15 minutes. <laughs> and it says times two. I've never had a times two before, so it's going to be extremely interesting whether we can fend this one off or not. At the moment, I think the one thing with defending settlements that's lacking is the ability to put fences up uh, that have gates. So they're not really holding anybody out unless you completely fence your settlement in. And then obviously from the testing I did, you couldn't get in or out, your NPCs couldn't get in or out, they were basically stuck. What's that up here? We've got some bandits, alright they're on the road so we'll try and avoid them. Actually gonna walk past my settlement I think, so get back there quickly. Right, we're nearly home. Just realized something. Um, foraging, logging, 
trapper's camp. We haven't built a trapper's camp. Uh, collect eels, channel traps, reset them automatically, it requires res Okay, um, we need to do that. I just remembered we researched it, but we got to build it. Alright, let's uh, first of all get rid of the stuff I have on me. animation bug there you can hear the walking back and forth as well it's oh that'll do it's sleep till the morning and people everybody's asleep i'd say all right the day of the battle now the way i did this last time is like creating a small little kind of a like army i guess you could say when when it when it says it's intimate i want everybody to kind of be back in town so to speak uh, we'll need some wood. We run out of wood really, really quickly. It's interesting. Uh, so spoiled items for those who haven't seen it in the other ones you need to put them into uh, an area to get rid of them because you just drop them they stay there and they end up in your they just basically keep going back to your storage they don't disappear i'll show you where they put that in a second thing to hide we had hide but okay Let's try and get this fire working all right and pelt hmm I got the other one hide okay I oh, know it was pelt too was it it was. I guess I don't have any hide. Alright, fair enough. Research. I can't do that. Cooking. Yeah, uh, to get rid of items that you don't need, you basically pop them in here. Says spoiled food. Okay, we definitely need some more bows, so that didn't work. What the hell happened in? Okay, we're gonna keep you with me for the moment. Actually, no, we'll wait. We'll wait. We'll do it as though we just getting told about our attack. Um, but we will get through the research book. Yep. Okay. Which, strangely enough, we, we don't happen to have a research ability or attribute, I should say. Which is kind of, I thought, you're relying on other people to do the research for you. Alright, so we're waiting for an attack. Um, 
I just smacked her. She's got a broken bone or something. Um, mm, okay. Do we have any bandages? Is that going to help? Now this guy's kind of useless. I can't even give this guy a. He's got a club. He, he's not high enough level to actually. What a lambier, uh, lubimir. I could get rid of him and try and get a better person from the village. It's actually pretty easy to get rid of these guys. Although I think he does a lot of my researching. Eh, it doesn't really matter that much. Um, let's take that off him and. Can we take that away? No. What happens when I take everything off him? <laughs> I didn't realize you could do that. All right, we're gonna send you off. To, we're gonna get rid of you. We're gonna expel you. And we uh, got seven hundred renown now. Um, I might just get you to be a worker for the moment. We're going to run up to the village. See if we can get someone with that 700 before this um, attack comes. Because he is pretty useless. That guy can't even give him a sword or a shield or anything. What's that? Oh, that's the village sound. Alright, we're looking for person over here maybe we'll have a look oh I got my weapon out okay hang on a second are you new in town it's husband not yet traveler uh, if she's 900 can't wait to get, to get her though we will respond in she's got some good skill sets there that come in handy uh, what about this one are you new in town no, we don't want the weaver. Um, let this guy be here. Uh... Are you new in town? Oh, how it's much I would give I'm you sorry, leftovers from the Lord's But feast. I just can't bring myself to trust you yet. We are wary of strangers. He's, pre he's pretty good, but he's just underneath what I need. And we Maybe don't want these beggars. Have you seen the elder yet? These guys have got terrible, terrible. Uh, just spoke to him. Alright, there's quite a few people up this way. Let's go over here. Hello, friend. Ah, oh, this is the carpenter. Uh, this guy said he'd make me anything I wanted if he got better. He seems to be better, but I don't seem to have a dialogue. Uh, I did a quest for him. Um... She's so be careful around her. Unfortunately, yes, I there's no time else. to lose. Mm -hmm. And yes, yes, I did. But during what? I've been through all this before, so yeah, he's. Those peasants right. should be more grateful. All right, we got up here. This guy's got some good skills, I if I remember. Asking if there is anyone who could help him out with these lands are my home. How do but. I know you won't bring trouble to? Th no good there. On her. Spare a coin for an old soul. Looking for trouble? Have you seen the elder yet? Yes, I have seen the elder. Seen That's one thing. To to Nine hundred. Seems to well, get harder and harder. Yeah, what you got for me, pal? Ask away. I'm sure the lad is all right. The problem is. All right, then. <laughs> get to. It. Um. People seem to be getting harder to recruit as I, because I swear this guy here, I was able to recruit him a few days ago. Sorry, I'm busy. Go find, I'm 
I'm sure you mean well, but you're still earning your place in this place. Right now I need 1,200 renown. So, yeah. Have you seen the Elder yet? Now, she is a lot better than the guy we just had, but still not amazing. But she's the best one so far. How about this lady? Sorry, I'm busy. Go find the village elder. He should be okay, she's, she's terrible. Just a few pennies to stay ah, these guys Are all look the same. It's I'm sure you mean well. Right, kill the dress. I'm trying to remember all his names and who you spoke to. Get stuck between a cat and a branch. Sorry, I'm busy. You are in no position to make such an offer, traveler. If you raise your standing in the village, I will reconsider Shh. your offer. She would have been excellent. She's only I got 40 short though. Keep going. Alright, we kinda of like don't have many options. Looking for trouble? That's one more dude over here, maybe. Let's go and check this guy out. Are you new in town? It, I'm sorry, but I just can't bring myself to ah, 50 yet. something as well. So keep your head down and your mouth shut. If All right. I'm going to have to take that girl. I think she was better than the one we got rid of, so I just need to find her again. And that's her there probably, I think. Come closer. Sorry, I'm busy. Go find the village elder. He should be able to help. All right, so... All right. She will hopefully just follow me back to... She has no weapons. All right, we need to sort her out with weapons. coming all right we need to put some weapons on her um and let's hope that's enough get our guys sorted for these well these expected attacks i don't know what the two means either two attacks or twice as many people as last time one of the two This is my storage for weapons. Um, we need... Oh, perfect timing. Okay. Uh, let's give you a weapon. Oh my god. Alright, we kind of like left this to the last minute, haven't we? Um, companion. 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 Companion, yep. Companion and all right. They're all getting ready. Um. All right, we got um. Who's this guy, Mavis? He's got a club. So why is he not? Oh, okay, he hasn't got it on him. Um, we want Ben in a separate. All right, we have five companions. Let's have a look at the army. We we can create a, a squad just for Ben. Was it? Yep. So we'll put Ben with me, and uh, Ben can follow. Yep, and the other two, four I should say, can... Oh, where's this attack coming from? Okay, it's coming from over that way. So, let's put these guys out here. And can follow me. Who 
Anyone got weapons? Yeah, okay. Wish I had another shield. Um, Alright, give them bend there for the moment. I can't see anybody just yet. I do have shield. I should have a shield somewhere. I just don't know where I've put it. God. It should be in there. Oh, um. Take that. Is he actually. Make sure he's got. Okay. Oh, there we go. Shit. Attack. Alright, she he's going for it anyway. Alright, cool. pretty easy uh, doing it that way so I have I have a lot of trouble in the past like keeping these guys at bay but that seemed to work well the, the rewards for our effort were pretty average it'd be nice to get some straps although we've got some gold and that's about it all right well we had four attackers we Got rid of all of the, the attackers. And we can disband our army. I wonder if we can do that from in here. The other guy, he just took off. Um, and you disband. Yep, okay, there we go. Back to working. Try preparing her a bit more. All right, that seemed to work pretty good. Uh, the attack icon is gone. Um, the little two, not sure what that was about. Actually, I want to see this guy over here where he actually has any arrows on him. All right, well, that was the, the I guess, the <laughs> attack on my base. A settlement, it was, you know, is that right? Okay, we set look at inventory. No, he, he doesn't. So that probably would help if he had some. Let's give him some. That way he can actually fire them off. Let's see what that lady's wearing. I took the clothes off that other guy we got rid of, didn't I? I don't know if he's still running around in his underwear. There she is over there. We're gonna just get her to come to me. All right, let's have a look. Yeah, so she's arm um, is five. It's a vest. Then we have one, one. I don't even know what that is. What's that? Trousers. Okay. She's got a little bit more armor, and it's not. Amazing, but all right. Good to go. We still have uh, some issues with the boars. Uh, I haven't been able to find a boar. Uh, we need a fur just to, to make things. Um, so there's a few things that this play test did kind of reveal. It was quite hard to find some things. If you think this is something that you're going to be interested in, jump on Steam and hit that wish list and it'll let you know when it's available and how much for. But I am pretty excited. I'm going to do one, another video uh, just comprehensively covering everything. It'll be a more edited version. Um, and I just see someone on the hill over there. Who's that? Yeah. Okay. It's just someone up there. Who is that up there? I'm going to check this out quickly before we finish off. 
We have Bandit. But yeah, so I'm enjoying it. It's got lots of stuff to happen. Obviously, it's still I'm probably a little ways away from being released. But that's the point of this playtest was just to... Ah, it's the dude in his underwear. That is hilarious. He's still wandering around up here. He needs to get some clothes on. All right, well, there you go. Um, my initial review based on the fact that there's still some work to be done, I guess, you know, it's probably an, a 7 or an 8 out of 10. I think it could get this could get to a 10, this game. It just really needs to iron out some of those bugs. It seems a bit open worldy in some areas but that could be fixed like up those mountains i ran and ran forever and nothing happened uh it's really hard to find certain things uh when it says they're available like boards for one i haven't seen a board and i've covered and a reasonable amount of the map you can see that's the entire map there that we have on and that's quite a big chunk and not a one bore so um and there, yeah there is no real icon for for boards so that would probably be the only thing I would suggest that they work on, um, find, being able to find things a little bit easier. And because um, that could be tedious having to, yeah, not be able to research further ahead without finding one particular item, which is like as hard as hell to find. So anyway, uh, one bad out. I hope you enjoyed this, guys. And um, yeah, I look forward to, I'll do another comprehensive cover tips and tricks that I've learned so far in this one as well for when this does come out. So uh, hit that like button, subscribe, so you get that content. And we will see you on the next uh, Wombat Gaming video. And again, thank you guys.